you guys went down into a sewer to investigate what you weren't really sure were at the time, but uh, after investigating and uh, deftly avoiding, you know, after the initial gas trap that you guys tripped and got nuked Whoops. with. Yeah. You <laughs> deftly avoided getting sucked down a drain and uh, managed to disable, like, the whirlpools in a sewer. Trekked your way around, found a uh, bunch of rickety bridges, decided, screw that, we're going back the other way. Went down a different path and uh, beat the crap out of a portcullis and opened that up and turned a corner and you were in a room full of uh, weird pod things. And when you decided you were going to, uh, you know, blow up these pods with a fire spell, uh, the creatures from the pods began hatching and... uh, and uh, several larger, uh, more developed, what appeared to be the same creatures, uh, came out of the water and attacked you guys. So clearly this is also Tig's fault. Yeah, something like that. I'd blame Groven, personally. Yeah. <laughs> God damn it, Groven. All right, uh, so... You should have asked this last time. Even though, like, big, what was it, like a Ravager or something? It still wasn't yeah. the one that was, like, sized like what Flint saw, right? Yeah, no, no. The the, the 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 bit the ones that you saw, which were like full size, you thought were adults, were not even close to the size of the thing Flint saw. Mm-hmm. Oh shit! But yeah, you're in this room and you see these large uh, brass domes, with uh, it appears to be a large a large cylinder actually, like right here, uh, going all the way up to the ceiling. <clears throat> Elevator shaft. I don't know. Dungeoneering of some kind, I <laughs> guess. Uh, I have dungeoneering. Yeah, it is. It is, in fact, dungeoneering to, uh, you know, for dungeon things. My wisdom allows me to have good dungeoneering, even though I'm not trained in it. So let's try that. Flint, Yay. the nature guy, can do that. Yeah. We have three decent dungeon No, he errors, can't. I he think. can't do that. He's not good at that. I lied. I'm sorry. I can act like I know anything about engineering. <laughs> Just leave it to the people who live in forests to figure out the sewer system of this urban environment. Man. Don't worry, guys. Yeah. I don't okay, know. with 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 Ackerfelts, you know, water's coming out of it. Oh, okay. <laughs> I'd imagine it's some kind of like process, I don't know, pump thing. I don't know. It's a something. I'll we'll give it that. Filtration. I don't know. It's it. Ooh, I know. Let's consult my fortune yeah. cookie. Oh my. Oh, you hemic. Do you have any idea what it is? Oh, I thought we just... Oh, Hemic does know what it is. These are drainage pipes for a very large structure. Uh, usually these things have uh, maintenance hatches inside them for, you know, maintenance and stuff like that with ladders. You just have to find the actual hatch to get inside it in the first place. It's an elevator. Go jump inside. Well, my fortune cookie does say you will be blessed, so... In bed. <laughs> no, it says you will be blasted. Oh, right. In bed. <laughs> Let's see even worse. The first part is a new relationship that's about to blossom. In bed. Yep. <laughs> uh, fortune cookies. Later. Dirty, dirty, dirty fortune cookies. Well, oh, now I don't want to eat for it. those, this is the end of the line. Right? Like, there doesn't seem to be any other way out of this room besides the way we came in. There is that door back there that we tried to open and failed. But, me guys, we're overlooking the most important part. We're in a room, but we're not making Tommy so jokes. <laughs> what is everybody... Oh, never mind. This personal light source. I have, I have it where it's indicating light sources on. I was like, I thought only one person had a torch. Then I remembered everybody has a little personal light source. I just have mining helmets on. Yep. Uh, remind me what where that door was again. Uh, it's right here. Oh, okay. Um, well, 
Well, since now we can actually cross the water without getting us killed. Uh, mm. Over here. Oh, excuse me. What's well, so easy? Right, there we go. go. And then hop up here. And up. I remember. Um, uh, I remember my another hover drow I did that was a, a storm a storm sorcerer so you hover midair with levitation pop your cloud of darkness and start shooting lightning bolts at people <laughs> <laughs> the angriest cloud ever all right so yeah door multi-class into a druid you get a wild shape so you can be a swarm so, if i remember it was locked we only yes, couldn't open it, and we couldn't sounds. break it down. Actually, you could probably get a. That's pretty item heavy. It's pretty heavy. Sound. Boy. Yeah. Hemic didn't do a theory on it yet, but no, that's about didn't. it for our options, I believe. Trying to do here. There's a door below Archipelt. Yeah, we couldn't get through it last okay. time. Well, Roland yeah. couldn't. If you prod me into trying, I'll try it. That's what we're gonna do. Oh. Well, you hit the dungeon check. Uh, Donnie dropped from the call. Wow. That's a new uh -oh. one. Uh oh. Rip. <laughs> you said.